No. became Listen. If you I became Nata. I'm such a... So here I am, waiting for speakers to speak. Well, I've been there and I've seen myself the streets of Israel. And they clearly just see with your eyes. As I said, Muslims, Jews, Christians, atheists, gays, lesbians, sitting in the, playing in the same parks, shopping in the same shops, in the same shopping mall. Actually, arranged marriages work more than the same. You don't have that. Arranged marriages. Gender. It's not a Muslim. It's not an Islamic thing. Really? I've never heard that. I've never heard that before. Where um the parents decide yeah, yeah, yeah. that the child is going to marry. Yeah. They decide. Yeah, it's 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 I'm talking about arrangement. We're just saying, do you know there's a nice girl that lives down the road? Why don't you get together? That's, what an that's not arranged. That no, it's because right, you go deep. You go deep. You might as well say Tinder is an arranged marriage. It happens in any community. You know, yeah, yeah, it's to a degree. Friends, you know, to what less of a place you know, yeah. and, and boys, they, they introduce each other. Just, just an introduction, formal introduction. Form form introduction. Anyway, are are you so, so what's your understanding for age marriage? Sorry, I, I, I'm just like, I'm really curious. Uh, that's that's always where, where the parents decide who their children are. No, that's what's going to do. They don't want to sit there and want to kill They're arranging. And is this right or wrong? Some people have been killed, haven't they? What do you think? It depends what the degree of... Choice for the individual. Right. You're talking about no. arranged marriage. Arrange marriage when two right. okay. if, if, if the girl says I can't stand him, I don't like his marriage. Yeah, and she has the freedom of choice to say no. Then I'd be okay with that. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Is this, is this something to do with religion? I, I, I didn't think it was, but this guy was telling me that it's the norm in Israel. And I'd never, I wasn't aware of that. Another another example. Another example. But it's not part of religious script. Another example. Another example. Really interesting and this is very confusing. Are you saying from an Islamic perspective, like you know, yeah. Matt? And that's why I wasn't yeah, aware like, of it. Yeah, I, 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 like I'm a Muslim, my mum will tell me that you need to marry this girl. Oh, no, that's, for, that's forced marriage. Right. The difference is, one, your mum and dad will tell you you have to marry this girl. Right. That's forced marriage. Right. Arranged marriage, your mum will tell you, why don't you meet this guy? She, she comes from a good family. And that's, that's, what I, that's what my understanding is. That's arranged marriage. Yes, He's yeah. trying to make a arranged marriage out of forced marriage. Right. That's the difference. It, uh, Another example way, of marriage is when, you say, you see a girl that catches your eye. You wouldn't go up to her like... Come on, man. Yeah, you're a Western dude, right? Huh? You're a Western man. Yeah, no, no, but I still stick to my culture. You're born here, right? I stick to my heritage. So you know how it is. When, 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 when a girl, when a man comes, he'll make a decision. My understanding of marriage is that, alright, you know, one of the rules. One man, long time. The woman must accept the man, and the man must accept the woman. So basically, and this is rule in Islam, you know, she must say, I accept from. Well, well, it, is, it, is, it doesn't have to accept. The woman must accept the man. You're saying she, she, has, she has the choice to accept. It's an option. Yeah, she has the choice to accept. Yeah. It's an option to accept. Does that mean there's an option to accept? Right, right. She can say no if she wants to. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, yeah, 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 yeah,
Yeah, I said, uh, to, no, get married. Married. to get married, no, she has to say she's she must. Not. She must. Oh, she, she has a choice. She has a choice. She has a choice. Yeah. 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 Yes, yes, yes. What's, your, what's your country? Right? It doesn't matter my country. Yeah, it doesn't matter my country. You know, like, we, we are living in like you know, beautiful, amazing world. You know, I am, I am, I am. You know, I am from Palestine originally. That's where Jesus was born, and he's Palestinian. He does not have blue eyes. He looks mostly like me. I don't even right. think he. Could. <laughs> yeah. His mum Mary was with veil. All right, like most of the Muslim ladies. I'm not Christian, and, can I just? And I never, I never came across. You know, Spoiler alert! I'm not I lived, I lived most of my life in the Middle East, and you know, I, I, you know, most, you know, I know other people. It's my culture, and to be honest, I never came across like a mum or a dad to her son. You know, you, what you must marry this person. You know. I wasn't protesting. It is what you were claiming. You know, this is what you were claiming. You know. But I also said I have no knowledge of that. Well, wait, 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 so wait, whatever I think it or thought it was. In Islam, you try to prevent the women and men from leaving each other before yeah. any marriage and to determine their real relationship. Yeah. Like now, in the common generation, in the, in the new generation, the good people, they go out and have a they get a they do their thing, and they, they don't have necessarily to create a family. Do you think that's happening now? Most I tell you, most nightclubs are closed down. Doesn't even exist, doesn't exist. Honestly, that's not the point. Our point is right now. So honestly, you said something beautiful. I'm sorry, you said something really beautiful. You know, tender, tender. It's like it's arranged, but it's serious. It's the same way. You know, just like it might have been about three years ago. You know what I mean? Because, because, you know, long time ago, it wasn't like open like now. And it's not only in Middle East. It's not only in Palestine. Okay, like and everywhere. It used and, to be, you know, a man to go speak to the lady. Sideways you know, so it wasn't so something really common. I ain't been here for so, a long time. So, you know, the mum is so making to the Have you heard of the expression opposite the train? Last week, was it? I, and I think that's quite a good and true thing. So again, if you're only marrying people who your parents know, you know, family friends, neighbors. That's not going to happen. Is that right? it's, it's, it's I think it's better when people from different backgrounds and cultures. You're, you're entitled to your opinion. Of course, not. I'm not saying this is the only way to get married. Yeah. Right. I say today I'm working my a bank. Here's the problem. Try and talk to her. Get her parents' number. Get her to the father. That's one of the options. Yes, yes, yes. 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 It's beautiful. Do you want one? Can I? Uh, this, this will be a rare scenario. Do you have parents aren't alive or live your life? I did this on purpose. So you can study. Come down, come down. and it's a believer of Islam, you're trying to marry. There's no problem but saying no. Like unless, unless there's a good reason why of his... Uh, yeah, she wants his politics. You know, if you think about yeah, it the other way, it's respectful. So imagine she like she 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 No, it's assuming your parents have a better judgment than you have. It is not the way. Is that always the case? It's not always the case, but stop generalizing. You know the Parents normally have, what, the average person gets married, the has kids at that. You see, some people have kids. That's why you can't get away with it. You see some people that have kids. I do. I don't, I don't think they still have dogs. That's somewhere. not relevant. Really no. no, it is relevant right, because there are some people who are just very bad, bad parents. Well, I haven't been here for three years. You said have I seen people have kids? So why should we give the parents the, the, the judgment of the you know, who's better for your life? Aren't you the better judge of who's right for you? Yeah, man. You can do. No one's saying you can't judge. But this is an option. It's only an option. You have kids, you have kids. Do you know your kids like well? Alright, so your daughter today, she brought you... Early? No. It used to be... Today, she brought you... Uh... That's not a swear word. They're not in the right place. I think it's...
If you're some brought a prostitute, hundreds of Are prostitutes not human beings? No one said that. Maybe, he, would you maybe not he could advise put him, her on the right would you path. Not advise assuming prostitutes. Well, well, everyone has different values. No one's judging. I no agree judging. with you. Everyone has different no values. But yeah. like, you wouldn't like. I don't so think. So prostitutes you know, don't deserve to fall in love and get married. I never said that. I never did that. Come out my mouth. But I should be avoiding my son having a Can you let me finish? And then I'll talk. One of the characters, the characters of her being a prostitute. Uh, okay. Another, she was a junk, everyday drunk, never sober. Another one, she's uh, she's just got foul mouth. Should we give up on this? Huh? We give up no on one said you should give up, but if he brought her as she is, and he said, Dad, I want to if get my, married. If my son fell in love with such a woman, and he could turn her life around, I'm like not talking about turn her life. then I would, I'm telling I would you, commend him more than If your son came else. today and said, I want to marry this girl as she is, or would you not advise him? No one think you should stop it. Would you get advice of song, maybe it's not that you were just an argument. What did you say? So you say you say that. Come on! I've got the authority. I'm not going to get it. I still think, and there is a value to it. You're, 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 you should be the prime judge of who's right for your relationship. No, 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 it's not like that. Parents helping you with the choices, telling you how to do it. Yes, how it's very loose. Parents has no authority to do it. There's no strict reason. Authority without reason. Okay. They can advise you. Who decides whether or the elders are more experienced than without reason? The reason we have in Islam is that they have to be a Muslim. They have to have good. So you can't marry a non-Muslim. Actually, men can marry non-Muslims. I know. But I married non-Muslims. I married non-Muslims. Well, a man can well marry a non-Muslim, but a woman can't marry a non-Muslim. Okay. We don't quickly expose the misogyny of your religion. Yeah. Only. I don't. I don't believe. I don't want to feel like we're attacking you. I don't speak it. I can take it. But I am. As long as it's only verbal, I can take it. I am. I am Muslim, and I married non-Muslim. You married a non-Muslim. Non-Muslim. Yes. So that's okay under the rules. It's only if it's only if it's the other way around. It is. It is not. And no, it's not. It's not allowed. Why is that? We follow. We follow certain rules. But what's the logic? I understand there's logic behind. It is. We we believe all for God. All of us for God. And I am Muslim, for example. I am Muslim. I believe in my logic. I believe in Muslims. As as he was a prophet, and I believe in Jewish religion. All right, so I'm allowed to marry from there. I I believe in Je so I believe in woman, Jesus. Could a Muslim I believe in Jesus. I believe in Jesus. So I'm, uh, I'm allowed to marry. You know. If but can a Muslim woman marry a Jewish man? Uh, no. He must believe. He must you believe see, in Muhammad. This is the humanity he I want to live in. <laughs> it is. It says you can't fall in love with you. You can't fall in love and marry you. We, we have because we, of your religion. That's not yeah, society. Man, that's not man, morality. Man, that man, we follow. We follow. We follow God's man. orders. We live by well, God. Yeah, but rules. I thought Islamic law is based in logic. Well, well, it, 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 is, it is, is Islamic law based in logic? It's a man, I tell what, That's what I told it, him. It, 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 so it, 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 a man, a man so can't marry uh, other than Jews and Jews. So even the man is not allowed to marry no, 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 even the man is not allowed to marry other Jews. Yeah. Yeah. But How's that good for human minds? I do what? It, is, it, is not, it doesn't mean that there is a sure you question it. Well, I'm an engineer, well, I'm not stupid. You know you what go. I mean? Like, I mean, like, you know, I, like if, I have, if I have a friend, no, it's Hindu, it's I wouldn't tell him, like, no, it's something like that. What if you, if you weren't married and you fell in love with a Hindu? I wouldn't marry because I fell in love with one. I fell in love with one. I think, you know, it's a bit more about relationships. No, ask her to be a Muslim. I fell in love with God. I fell in love with God. I fell in love with God. What if you fell in love with him? What's it called? I'm not sure. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Why is God setting these rules? For a reason. For a reason. What is the reason? Okay, let's say other religions. Do not talk about one other religion. 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 Yeah, but like for example, like he gets like some monotheistic religions. Yeah. He, did, he, did some, he did some roads where they say like, for example, this is like God. You're coming back. You're coming back. What's the respect to saying God? What is the logic? Let me tell you. 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 Let me tell
Because your entire living is, is oh, insular and you divisive. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Saying, we, you know, yeah. There's a perfectly wonderful, we this world fine is a woman who's a Hindu. Yeah. But no, love, love has a wall. Like Trump builds the wall. We the wall. We this world why, why are you making the way? Why are you building walls? And you don't think about the love between you and build God. bridges, not walls. No. walls. This is this is where this is where people come. They are believers and non-believers. You know what I mean? You you love. Come, they're, they're, they're believers. Believer. Again, I come back to the fact I live in Southall. I know there are lots of Hindu girls and Sikh girls who marry outside of their religions. All the time. No, it's not allowed. The religion, the religion. Well, allowed their religion my religion does not, not allow me. We think, you know, they're both. Well, of course, I'm allowed. So do Muslim people because they don't all they agree with you. There's some life is about to join. We've got money to Muslim. Muslim. Yeah, Muslim women. You know, I guess you probably, in a way, think they're not proper. Anyway, my standing. I was surprised to hear that young lad say what he said because I've never had any. It is. It is. It is. Arranged marriage is more like you say something really beautiful. I like it. You know, it's marriage. It is like you have a media like tender. Okay, introducing people together, and you either like it or no. As, as, a, as, a, as a young you know, person, I, I did not try it. Person, you know, I got married before this technology. As a young person, I was trying to navigate the dating market in 2023. Yeah. Right. Arranged marriage might actually be the best solution. That's why the young girls are going for it. And to be honest, mm. like you know, I, what I think as well, like what I notice, some people like you have a lot of choices there, a lot of things, and like you know, it can be good, it can be bad. Tend to so are you saying that there's an argument for more choices? In <laughs> it's just, just people start to be like, yeah, I'll, I'll try this. If it doesn't work, I'll try that one. As it's, not, it's not about, you know, marriage in Islam. We call it in Islam, mithaq qalid, which means like a really tight rope in relationship. And this being mentioned twice in the Quran. A strong it's covenant. About, what was that, sorry? A strong covenant. Yes, mm -hmm. covenant between two. You've got a bit of seed on your head. Oh, seed, yeah. There you go. That's <laughs> and, you know, some, it, 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 it be mentioned only twice in the Quran, I believe. It was mentioned about it's, it's between the man and woman in marriage, and also about religion, I believe, like between the human and the God. You know, it's it's really important. It's not it's not it's not a game. And and when the gentleman said the authority for the man, you know, it's a final decision, you know, for the man. Yes, there is nothing, and I'm not escaping from this. But like when I got married to my Christian wife. Alright, she basically I had a lot of uh, Muslim books. I was reading a lot. Just to answer, like if case you will have any question. You know, I was born as a Muslim. You know, I did not take religion. Uh, you know, from you know as convert, convert. You know, yeah. those people are m more like strongly because they, you know, they they just you know learn about it and they convert it. Myself, I was born as Muslim. Converted. I was I was born as Muslim. No, when when re I was Muslim. Reverted, not converted. Yeah, reverted, yes. Came back to the ah, yes. What's the difference? Uh, converted, change religion. Reverted, go back to the original religion. Because Islam is the original religion. Everyone must. It's, it's the religion of all the, all the prophets. Because yes, exactly. because That's you know, it's just slightly yeah. arrogant of a religion. <laughs> 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 no, it's not arrogant. No, it's not arrogant. It's, it's, it's the reality, the truth. But but every religion mm. and its followers think they and their religion is the no, right one. No, we don't say they? we say it's the religion yeah. of all prophets. I know, I know. Include, including Jesus. Jesus was a Muslim. Because he's sub Islam means but Christians, Christians. Christians. But Christians, Jesus Christians, was no, 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 he was no, not no. Jews, Jews were Muslims yeah, too. It's, it's, we <laughs> no, no. Listen that. to me. 
the, like the, Jesus the, was the, the name of religion in Islam became a bro, thing. That bro, can't be bro, right. Ju 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 Judaism came from the, the tribe of Judah. Yes. Yeah. So this is nothing to do with the the, the, the concept that they believed in. Yes. No, 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 no. Christianity no, comes no. from the word Christ. This is nothing to do with what we believed. Islam is not Mohammedan. That's what the people say. Mohammedan. So because, how? So what's the evidence the of its existence prior to Muhammad? Because it's submission to God no, and, and all the, the prophets. What's the evidence? Prior all the prophets. To all the prophets. All the prophets, uh, including uh, Moses, Judaism. Uh, but the, uh, where's the evidence of Islam existing it's, prior it's, to Muhammad? Because, because what, what yeah. Jews, yeah. What, what Jews believe? Again, what Jews believe? Steve. 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 Sorry, um, I have really bad memory. Uh, anyway, Steve, like you know, Islam, as as the man said, Islam is submission to God rules. So what's the okay. evidence of its existence? Was, hey, it was Abraham. We, we we believe that all prophets. You. Yes, Abraham. Sarah Abraham. and Abraham. And and, and clearly, it clearly agree, mentions the Quran. You know, Makana, Makana, Bra, uh, Makana. Makana, Abraham, we are Jews, and all Nasrani, and all that. But he was a Hanifa Muslim. Hanifa Muslim means that he he was. Abraham was not a Jew. Was not a Christian. He was only a. a, a and it makes sense, you know, you cannot argue about this one because it was Judaism and... Uh, okay, but okay, the, uh, when, the, when the religion was written down... Well, Judaism came first. Okay, Islam. what you're saying is it says mm. that everything was always Islamic, That's what I'm but saying there's no evidence. evidence. How many of you women would be willing to share a husband in Islam with three other women? How many of you would? How many of you? Without understanding... I can show you in the Quran. It says, take, take unto you one, two, three, or four. That's what it says. Not women, not women, men, men, women. Now listen, if this is S A, if this is S H I T to you, sir, I'm quoting the Quran, not the Bible. Now. Let's talk about Jesus in the Quran. See, once you talk uh, to Muslims about the book, they usually run away. Why? Well, you don't even know what it says. I'm reading it to you. Of course he is. If he kicks me off the ladder, I'll get up again. I've done it before. Listen. Without Jesus Christ, you cannot have peace in Psalm. That's why Jesus said, my peace I give you. Can you find peace in this world? Can you find peace in England? What's that? Jesus said, no, 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 you find it. I'm gonna. Jesus said, my peace I give you. Peace is when your sins are forgiven. Yes, I characterize that love in essence. What do you mean precisely? All right. When you and I repent to God through Jesus Christ, the Savior that died for the sins of the world, all of a sudden, happened to me 42 years ago, he raises the heart, forgives your sin, and you're a new person in Christ. All the, all the old things are liars. You are liar! You are Messiah! You are liar! You are this, liar! This is I the am Messiah. Messiah! He's the Messiah of hell! You are liar! I am Messiah! Keep talking. He's a very good example of a bad example. Okay, no, 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 stick, stick around. Bible and Torah. Did you understand? Did you understand? It's through repentance. No, through repentance. Do you believe you have sin? No, I, I, I have it. Two seconds. Do you believe you have sin? No, 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 no. That's not. Let's not turn it into a no. debate. Sir, like a sir, and we're just talking. Else. No, characterize. Close your eyes and pretend no. it's just you and I right now. No, characterize that piece and this kind of spiritual awakening that you've just mentioned right now. Yes. Characterize it for us in essence. Describe it. Okay. Precisely in intricate detail. What does it imply? You How want, does it impact you? you want With detail. the relation to a second with the relationship yes, with the Lord, no. with yourself, and how you become subject of your own identification soon after that awakening. Okay. Characterize it for us. Answer the question. Fantastic question. Fantastic. I like it, sir. Thank you, sir. You're welcome. Let me put away the Quran. We're done with that for a moment, right?
No, let's not, let's not get into no. anyone's boots. Sorry, I'm I'm not is enough, like, yeah. Yeah. He has a good question. Yeah, I don't good. usually have good questions. Well, answer it then. Usually he speaks. Answer the question. That's it. Answer. Would you, would you be quiet up to answer the answer? Answer the question. <laughs> no, sir. Do you believe you're a sinner? Yes. Let's not establish an argument like that. that I'm not trying to answer your question. No, I answer. You cannot answer the question. I am. Say your lawyer. All have sinned. You are all you have fallen short seconds. of what God expects. Two seconds. You and I are the same. Two seconds. No difference. You had your ten seconds. Two oh, times. Four. Four. Answer the question. Answer the question. No. I'm trying to help you, sir. You don't need no, no. Let me answer the way I want to answer. Characterize I am the speaker. Right now, you're becoming a squeaker. Now, listen. Jesus Don't Christ me, though, yeah? came to this world yeah. to forgive our sins. But that's and a preaching answer. Go of to that course it's preaching. Everything about God is preaching. Why don't you like preaching? No, because the manner in which you're doing it, you're not leaving any room for further scrutiny and questioning. I just am trying to answer your question, but Be what, I do, what I do is not good enough for you. When Christ died for my sins, I've heard that million times. Characterize that piece. Sir, again. do you have patience? <laughs> I am more than you. Well, then shut up and listen. Okay, go All right. No, you don't have patience more than two seconds. Yeah, I do. Yeah. But not that the way that Just, you're answering it. You voice. got two ears. Listen with both. Go for it. Jesus became my savior and changed my soul and gave me peace. Through the forgiveness of my sins for be quiet <laughs> over 42 years ago when i was 17. Uh, all right and soon after when that i was 17. Happened. and since that time my life has gotten that i'm going to say it like the british would bat uh, and bat uh. and you well, that's right a a a a I, I just figured you out why nada. he's right here i'm you sorry he's on toast his face no nada. listen if you I'm, became nada. I'm such a nut uh, that's why you're so close no now listen sir i'm sure i didn't answer all that you wanted to hear no, no, so i will continue no, this world, Express yourself. this world, as we all know, has many temptations. Guys and girls, but mostly guys, four words for you. Stay off the internet. It's not helping. Hey, hey, teach your kids. Sounds like Taliban to me, pretty. If it's, oh, really? Yes. Why? If you, oh, two seconds. I didn't you say you can help me. Allow me, allow me, allow me to talk. Sorry. I didn't say, I'm talking about temptation. No, two and seconds. And I'm talking no. about if me. You got good, Sir, you're on your two second rule has run out. You can utilize anything. That's just nonsense, Taliban, Ayatollah. What does that say, Ayatollah sir? Jesus. What's that say? Right, exactly. Hey, get back here! I'm not done with you yet! Don't shoot me, sir! I won't shoot you! That's, I think, your job! What's that say, anybody? Yeah! IQ test! Okay! You're in it now! What's it say? IQ test! That's it? I, I, the, the other words are in bold for you! What is this say? God is nowhere, he says! But, what does it say to you, sir? In the hat. What's it say? You, you. What's that say to you? Can't see it? Oh, bring it closer. What does that say to you, sir? God is nowhere. What's that say to you, sir? You are not So this guy is reading it better. It says, God. Is now here. You are not no longer. See, we all decide if we want God in our lives. And when we decide God is nowhere, like you, sir, you become your own God. 
like false messiah. Right? You are not But all you are not all have sinned. You are not all of us. I don't like Christ. Every one of us need God's grace. When I say every one of us needs God's love. How do you get God's love? How do you get it? You just say, God, love me. For God, give me. Right? He says, even Every time I ask him how to prove it, he says, I don't know how it began. I don't know how the world came about. I'm a son. Good afternoon, sir. How are you today? Good afternoon. God re revealed to me, God said, you are the Messiah. No, right. I appreciate God revealed himself to you. He said you are the Messiah a couple of years ago. You actually told me that God sent you an email, but what you failed to do was tell me what God's email address was. And you also told me yeah, that you facilitated the Northern Ireland peace process and you also met many, so not you met, there were, there were presidents and you engaged with Jerry Adams and all kinds of different people, yes? And I persuaded the IRA to stop bombing London. All right then, so we, I can engage with you later on at some stage, I know you're going to be here today, and you have been nicknamed the Messiah. That's your new name. So I'm now going to speak to someone who I haven't seen since October. So if you move over, sir, I'm just letting you know I will be, that's it, I will be engaging. How can I prepare you for Jesus when everybody will be dead? There is nothing oppressive about being a housewife. There's nothing oppressive about being a stay-at-home mother. Hello, Thomas. Hi, how are you? Hi, I'm fine. How are you? I'm doing very well. Yeah, we met here in the South, South Park Corner, uh, Speaker's Corner. A lot of people sharing their, their thoughts, their worldviews. What is yours? I consider myself mostly a transhumanist. I mean, I think oh. the most important thing that we should be doing is figuring out how to stop aging and living a very long time. Imagine waking up in the body of a 25-year-old and it's your 300th birthday. Now, that's obviously very far in the future. What you call me now, I'm a transhumanist, but I'm a men's rights activist. I'm an American. I'm mostly conservative, but I'm also liberal in many of my views. I support LGBTQ rights. Um, I support green energy. I think that science and technology should be the most important things that governments focus on. Right. I, I see some contradiction uh, in your worldviews because on one hand uh, you're uh, defending men's rights, but uh, on the other hand transhumanism. I, 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 for me it seems it co contradicts itself and L LGBTQ as well because it somehow uh, empowers the opposite to uh, men's rights, isn't it? No, I mean, I don't think so at all. I think men's rights is simply about addressing inequalities that affect men and boys today, mm -hmm. which is hopefully a short-term problem. But transhumanism is the long-scale problem that humans should worry about. The fact that we age and grow old and die. And I don't think that we have to. I think the day will come when human beings will wake up and they'll be 500 years old and that'll be normal. And that sounds crazy now, but if you go back to the 13th century and you tell them that one day we're going to put a rocket on the moon, they would think that you're crazy. Mm. So with all the modern science that we have now, our understanding of senescence and stem cells and gene therapy and nanotechnology, is it really so crazy to think that we're going to find a way to slow down human aging and make humans stay young, healthier and longer? I don't think so. Mm, sounds reasonable. Uh, so w w what would you say about um, quite obvious obstacle, like uh, amount of people, you know, because uh, yeah, obviously uh, ex expanding our life span uh, makes us more, more people uh, around, more resources needed, isn't it? In terms of resources, you could take the entire population of the Earth 
and give them the property of the size of Buckingham Palace and only use the state of Texas. We have many, many, many millions of empty square miles of desert that we could turn into farmlands. We could build vertical farms and have sunlight going through glass windows and grow crops. We could build floating crops on the ocean. There is so much empty space on planet Earth. I think the biggest obstacle to transhumanism and life extension isn't so much the science. I mean, the science is obviously crucial, but I think it's the politics and the religion. Those are the two things that I think get in the way the most. Hmm. And the amount of people uh, to go around itself, themselves, uh, wouldn't we uh, simply extend the uh, capacity of the planet for like a living space? Is it? I have absolutely. I think that when we start developing more advanced technologies, we would be eliminating greenhouse gases. We would be building more like kinetic energy, wind energy, hydro energy, nuclear energy. So I absolutely do think that we have the capacity to develop the technology to sustain this transhumanistic world with triple or even quadruple the lifespan with the resources that we have now. The problem isn't that we don't have the land or resources, the problem is that we don't use it efficiently. Hmm. Okay, sounds good, sounds fair enough. Uh, so what about the individual freedoms? Uh, about, uh, because now we live in a century of in, in times where uh, individual individualism, like a um, personal will, per personal um, freedom basically uh, is the core. However, it is switching slowly more to communist uh, approach. W would you agree with it? I'm actually very anti-communist and I'm very pro-capitalist. Are you? But the reason why I say that is because I look at the results that we've had so far. Capitalism has vastly outperformed communism by a very wide margin. You don't see people from capitalist countries flee to communist countries. But you do see people from communist countries risk their lives to come from capitalist countries. But a transhumanist society would be something completely different. We would be so far beyond, so far evolved beyond communism or capitalism, it would be a new era of humanity. So we would look at communism and capitalism the same way that we look at the ancient Romans. It's, it's outdated, it's, it's obsolete, you know, it's, it's over. I mean, we'd be in a whole new thing. Right, right, okay, okay, yeah, I, I hear you that we're looking quite distant future rather than... Uh, but for now, it seems that everything is getting more to centralized power, uh, along with also development of uh, like technologies like AI and the hive mind, because there is a lot of, well, maybe not a lot of, but uh, talking about hive mind, about, and this probably goes along with your tra transhumanism, yeah? Connecting uh, all our uh, consciousness, uh, all our, no, maybe not consciousness, all, all, all our minds, into one product so where where the individualism comes into play where we're talking about creating something uh, hive yeah, hive mind uh, does it make sense i think you could still be an individual in a society that has ai and i don't think there's anything wrong with a strong central government that uses technology to be most efficient i mean you could have an ai system that runs your government programs but you still make the choice to get up in the morning and make your breakfast and go to work i mean the fact that we use technology to make our lives better I mean, you could say the same thing 500 years ago. You could say, oh, you mean you all use the same buses to go to work? Isn't that against individualism? Because we use their own horse and buggies to make our own way to work. Mm. But now we have buses to go to work. I don't think there's anything unnatural about using technology to increase the human experience. Because here's the thing. I see technology and natural as the same thing. Because why? What develops technology? The human mind, the natural human intelligence is what makes technology happen. So technology is an excrescence of the human natural intellect. So I don't see them as being opposed. I see technology as a, a tool that humanity uses to expand itself. Right, right. Fair enough, fair enough. Uh, however, uh, about the corruption. Corruption, because uh, more power kind of uh, creates uh, more desire to use it, uh, to to put everyone that is under under the particular government uh, into control. Uh, I mean, would it, won't it kind of slip from our hands, like 
power to the people in a way. <laughs> uh, aren't we balancing on a very thin border to giving away? Oh, sorry, to ju just a side note about uh, the uh, CBDCs, about uh, central bank digital, because this is uh, overall connected, yeah? Because if we will give away the power uh, to control our uh, mm, finances, to be able to buy and sell, to make transactions to the central authorities, and some algorithms, some computer uh, ways that, that it, it will be possible to uh, cut, cut off our ability to buy and sell particular items in particular conditions to, uh, to create specific conditions in the society. Sorry, I'm going all, all around. All around but I would say, they said the same thing about the World Wide Web. They said the same thing about the Internet. The fact of the matter is, we create AI so we maintain control. Now. Do we have to make sure we keep control? Yes. But are we really going to stop ourselves from advancing because we're afraid of what's going to happen? Because this is going to be a conversation that we may have for the next 20 years. But in 200 years, they're going to look back at this conversation and laugh. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, or, uh, or our society will be so divided, so polarized that there will be only the uh, people on top, the elites, and they will be laughing, and all the other um, peasants, I don't know, doing their work. <laughs> well, there's really only one way to know for sure. <laughs> Let's live long enough to find out. Yeah, man. Uh, yeah, would you like to sum up with an uh, sure. additional... Sure. Uh, my name is Blue Orange 22 Yes. If you want to know more about me, you can... That's my logo, but... Okay, so that's where people can find you. Blue Orange 22 If you YouTube that, you'll find me and my Gmail. BlueOrange22MRA at gmail.com Nice one. We're gonna leave the link in the description below so awesome. people can easily connect. Uh, one more question. Uh, what does the logo symbolize? Nothing, actually. Nothing. I wanted something that was just uh, simple, eye-catching. I think the greatest logo of all time was McDonald's. Oh. Because it's very, very simple. It's two colors. It's red and yellow. It's a very basic shape, but you recognize it everywhere in the world. Yeah. So two colors, basic color scheme, basic is best. Right. I've always said the best logo ever made is McDonald's. <laughs> it's easy to draw, it's easy to remember, but you recognize it everywhere. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. yeah. Nice one, thank you so much for, for your time. Awesome, cool. Hey. For sure? Cheers. Would you like to tell, tell, tell us a few things about what are you up for? What do you um, preach? Ba basically, there's just two, two main, well, three main things I'm saying. I'm a believer in the Bible as the Word of God, but I don't believe that religions are, most religions are corrupt. They're not, they're corrupted in some way. Hmm. Um, but the main thing I'm saying is there's nothing good that you can do to make God love you more. There's nothing bad that you can do to make God love you less. God doesn't condone your bad actions, but there's nothing you can do to make God love you more or less. God mm. loves you no matter what. Also, there's no such place as hell where you're burning forever and right. ever and ever and ever and ever. There's no such place. There is a day of judgment where you will be destroyed, but there's not, you're not burning forever and ever. Okay. And those are the two main things I'm here for, really. Mm -hmm. The main issues. Right, so you, do you believe that the whole Bible is a word of God? About, I do. Yeah? Yeah. But that how that there were so many influences during during ages, during centuries. But were who, 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 who could influence God? 
I don't know the people that were... Uh, no, no. Who, who can influence God? Oh, no, no, of course not. Uh, but <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man, I hear you. But then on the other hand, there were like a... I, I don't know... Uh, I, had a, I have a friend that even is doing like some research into yeah. um, King James Bible, you know, that even King, ja King James and uh, the, um, his influence on Bible wasn't like really... Uh, well, you, you see, that's, translation. That's really, that doesn't really make sense because yeah. there's you know thousands of manuscripts that we have. Of the All right. Bible. So the, the Bible, you can't. King James couldn't have an influence on it because right, it was, right, right. the manuscripts were already there. Sure. Yeah. And do, did you hear about the Mandela's effect? Like what? Mandela effect? That the Bi that? Bible is being changed uh, supernaturally. That words in Bible are changing after they being written. So uh, and 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 I ever and Bible. See, yeah. that, that 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 to me wouldn't make sense because if I believe if I believe that there's a God, mm -hmm. I would believe that God is able to know what people are going to do. Yeah. So I would believe that God has a message that they want to get out to us. God the Father, God the Son, God the Holy Spirit right. want to get out to us, and they would know what people will do because mm -hmm. they know the future. They know everything. Yeah. So there's nothing that human beings can do to stop God getting their message out. Mm. Right. If there is a God, of course. Oh, so if the Bible is true. So no, even, I'm, just, I'm just saying so, because so you're I'm even questioning. I, no, I'm not no, questioning no. it. I'm just, I'm just saying. Yeah. I believe, you know, mm -hmm. you could. There's certain questions that, are, that can be put forward, posited, mm -hmm. but that's if you don't believe there is a God. Those of us who believe, we've got this, this brute fact of a Bible. It's a brute fact for most of us. There before we came. Mm -hmm. And we have to, as human beings, we have to deal with, deal with that. We have to deal with the fact that there was a person called Jesus Christ that everyone mm -hmm. knows, even from non-biblical sources, knows that this guy existed. From non-biblical sources. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So we have mm -hmm. to deal with these brute facts of life. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but, but, but then I, I heard also some, some uh, researcher, scholar, was saying that there are those two different um, versions of Jesus. There is like this historical girl, uh, Jesus, sorry, Jesus, so the person that l lived, and then there is like uh, this biblical uh, religious version. So uh, the no, question... No, I mean, the, 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 you see, like, I mean, <laughs> you see, the problem is people don't go to the Bible themselves. Yeah. Because the Bible is correct in all its assertions. In all its assertions. So for me, don't read what people have said about the Bible read what the Bible actually says and what Christ says mm -hmm. about himself and, and read what he says about himself. Don't read what scholars have said about him, yeah. read what the Bible says about itself. Start with that and then move out. Don't start with what they've said and then think, oh, well, uh, 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 no, this doesn't make sense. And well, it does. I mean, everyone starts from wherever they start from, mm -hmm. but it doesn't make sense. It makes sense to actually check out the documents for themselves. Right. I'm assuming you're right, are you? I assume right. You assume you don't know if you assume. Well, you just said you were. Don't be upset. And don't, don't be hiding. Don't hide from your religion. Embrace it. There you go. Embrace it. I'm not sure what you said, and I don't think I want to know. Why? You're speaking nice, not a big man. It didn't sound good. Oh, it sounds good. Look at it. But he doesn't sound good, does he? He said a baby boy grew up and became God. How can a baby boy grow up and instead of becoming a man, become God? We can't explain. Simple question. Oh, so so the Arabic could be wrong. The Arabic is right. Oh, oh, oh. You're wrong. Let's see if it's right. The Quran is very old Bible. How he knows about that Quran? That's it. He knows. Hey, get yeah. back here! I'm not done with you. He's not a preacher. Hey, He's a cowboy. Look at the hat. That's a yellow card. This is speaker's corner. Sometimes it is a bit exhausting. 
so much content, so much, uh, so many different ideas, and especially from the people that shout the loudest, like this, this freaking, I think, American guy. Uh, but yeah, so much good content, uh, and now I have to still edit all of it. Mm. That's the thing, also this transhumanist guy, it's like, it was quite mind-blowing mind uh, Because such a, such a different, such a weird views that actually I I used to op op oppose it to, or uh, I am opposed to